Hi, welcome to the SCCM Animal Care Center. I'm Celeste and I'm going to give you a tour of our zoo. The, some of the animals are from the San Nicolas Island. Abalones are a kind of shellfish. They are actually ocean snails. They live in the mild and warm seas. Abalones are found along the coast of Australia, California, Europe, Japan, New Zealand, and South Africa. Abalones eat blue kelp and other small plants and animals. They use their specialized zipper-like tongue to scrape algae. The inside of the abalone shell is very shiny. It's called the mother of pearl, and it's used for decorations and jewelry. Inside of the Blue Dolphin's book, Karana ate abalones for dinner, and she also fed them to her pets. She made things out of them like necklaces and fish hooks. Also, the colors of the abalone can be red, pink, purple, white, and green. Sea otters live in the North Pacific Ocean, and sea otters are part of the weasel family. They have webbed feet, water-repellent fur to keep them dry and warm, and nostrils and ears that close in the water. Sea otters are the only otters to give birth in the water. Mothers cuddle their young while floating on their backs and hold infants on their chest to nurse them. They quickly teach them to swim and hunt for themselves. Sea otters eat er sea urchins, abalone, mussels, clams, crab, and snails. The sea otter lies on their backs and cracks open shellfish. Karana was disappointed because the alleys were killing the otters for their skins. At the end of the story, Karana did not use the sea otter skins for her clothes anymore. She felt it was wrong because she now felt like they were her friends. Elephant seal is the name for the two largest kinds of seals. They live in the ocean near Antarctica and in the Pacific Ocean too. A male sea elephant can weigh up to 8,800 pounds. Families are much smaller. They are 10 feet in length and 1,500 pounds. Adult males may grow to over 13 feet long and weigh up to 4,500 pounds. The northern elephant seal is the second largest seal in the world, after the southern elephant seal. Elephant seals get their name from their large size and from the male's long nose. The nose looks like an elephant's trunk. If the elephant seal had a group and they would stay together, the group would be called the colony. Some of the elephant seal's teeth are as long as a person's hand and have its width. The elephant seal moves fast in spite of their size, waddling along on their great flippers, which they use as hands. Karana killed a bull elephant seal to have its teeth for the point of her spears. Some distance separates the bulls from each other, for they are bad-tempered, very jealous by nature, and quick to fight over anything that displeases them.
Hundreds of cormorants can be found perching in trees, on rocks, and on the ledges of sea cliffs. You can find them in many places around North America. They are always around water. With their feathered bodies, long necks, and flat heads, they look like rows of bottles sitting on the cliffs. The double-crested cormorant has greenish-black, bronze-tinted feathers. During the nesting season, it has a crest of curved white feathers behind each eye. It has an orange throat. The great cormorant is larger than the double-crested cormorant. It has white feathers bordering the throat. It lives on Island of the Blue Dolphins. Cormorants look for fish while swimming underwater. Karana kills a number of cormorants and made a skirt out of them. Dogs can be found in many parts of the world. There are many in in Australia, Southeast Asia, and Africa. They are called dingoes. Each year, female dingoes give birth in a cave or a hollow log to four or five young. The pups may live with their parents and help raise the next litter. Wild dogs look like normal-sized dogs, but wild dogs howl and rarely bark. In the book Island of the Blue Dolphins, Karana's little brother Rama was attacked by a pack of wild dogs and killed. Karana then killed three of the wild dogs and wanted to kill the leader. But after she shot it with an arrow, she saw that he was hurt, and she pitied him. He ended up being her pet. When she made the leader her pet, she named him Rantu because Rantu means fox eyes. Then a couple years later, Rantu was growing weaker and died. Then Karana lost her best friend. The next day, Karana saw that the wild dogs had a puppy that was actually Rantu's son, so she took the puppy and named it Rantu Aru.